What's happening guys? Welcome back to another episode of Ruse Reviews and today we are chatting about Principle by Pete Turner and Illusionist. So let's get into this. So what is Principle? Principle is three propless mentalism routines, all of which are perfect for performances over the phone, Skype, Zoom, virtual conferences, and they're also great for one-on-one -on -one performances as well. Some of you might have seen my last review, and if you haven't seen that, you will find it just here. Obviously, go to that after you've watched this one. But in that review, I talked about virtual tricks, virtual magic effects. And I mentioned in that most of the things I perform are mentalism or mind reading type effects. So as a mentalist, as a magician, I'm a huge fan of Peter Turner's work. Anybody who's a fan of propless mentalism should just be reading Pete Turner's stuff. There's a lot of great stuff out there. I've been using his Isabella Star pretty much since it came out, along with other principles that he's brought out. So what are are the three effects taught in principle. The first one is called Guess Who. So without giving too much away, the actual main effect that is given to the spectator looks like they can think of any name that they like. The performer plays a huge game of invisible Guess Who, asking them questions such as, does this person have glasses? What colour is this person's hair? And so forth, until it narrows it down to one person that the performer sees, he writes that name down and it matches the person that the spectator is freely thinking of. The second effect is overlooking the obvious. This is Pete's take on a brilliant pin reveal. The spectator basically follows you in their mind to an imaginary cash point and you can type in your pin code and they make up the pin code themselves. All numbers are freely chosen and at the end you can give them this impossible reveal of a pin code that they have just made up in their heads. And the third and final piece is a beautiful, beautiful drawing duplication called Abstract. This is Pete's take on an in the minds drawing application. Nothing has to be drawn out or written out by the spectator. It just happens all in their head. It should go without saying that everything Pete puts out, you know that the teaching is gonna be good. He always goes into great detail, the little nuances, the little tips, the little tricks that he uses to help further and better his performance. He teaches all to you. My actual favorite bits from this whole download are the Skype sessions that he has with Mark Lemon and Fraser Parker. I think they are brilliant. The conversation between them makes it feel like you're just in the middle of a jam that they're having themselves. And within that, there is just valuable information that isn't even in the main part of the explanation so whatever you do watch those Skype sessions that he has with Fraser Parker and Mark Lemon because you'll get these little nuggets of knowledge which will help you progress with propless mentalism so guess who as I mentioned at the start is a huge invisible game of guess who in essence what it looks like is Pete gives the spectator a free choice of any name that they like they then build this person up in their head what they look like what clothes they're wearing what their hair's like and Pete plays a game of guess who with the spectator and he knocks down and eliminates people till he's left on one person he writes down the name of that person and it matches the person the spectator is thinking of. What I like about this routine is the combination of principles. This whole project is named Principle, right? And that is because of all the little principles that come in to form the final routine. It allows for a beautiful framing of this Guess Who board, which I'm gonna use in other effects that I use now, because I think it is a beautiful way of framing and giving the spectators something to really focus on. And it allows the performer to sort of really delve into the spectator's experience, because you're essentially both visualizing these same things in your head. So overlooking the obvious, as I say, is a pin revelation. This is almost like the spectator as mind reader plot. It's like the spectator's gone to you, how have we done all those things? I would love to be able to try it myself and then you can do this routine with them. As we all know, the pin divination plot is one of the strongest plots in modern mentalism. And being able to do it properly, how Peter does it and shows you in this routine is just amazing to have in your back pocket. What you also learn in this routine is a principle by Michael Murray and how Peter incorporates that into making this seem as free and as clean and as open as this routine could possibly be. And the final piece taught in this project is called Abstract. This is based on an idea that Pete put out in his book, Bigger Fish 2, which I would highly recommend you go and buy. What I love about this is how Pete branches off 
from an initial principle and extends it to make it seem even more impossible. I think he has a way of being able to expand on principles in a way that I haven't seen a lot of mentalists do. And it's really refreshing to see how these things take form and take shape because everything happens in the spectator's minds and everything that you describe is forming and being reshaped and molded in their heads. And the fact that you can do all this stuff on camera over the phone, face to face, you don't need any props. Let me stress that again. This is propless mentalism. You can divine miracles with what you learn in this three routine download. Now, as a big fan of propless mentalism myself, I will say that there are probably aspects of Pata that work for Pete, but maybe don't always work for everyone else. I think he mentions in it that if you follow my Pata, you'll be fine. And that's true, you will, but if you wanna have complete control over the experience the spectator is having, you're much better off finding little ways to focus in and hone this into your own performance. The fact is some propless mentalism can be hit and miss. And the first time you see these things, or maybe even try these things out, maybe because you haven't got the patter down, or maybe because you haven't got the performance down yet, some of these things might not hit 100% the first time you try them. And that is generally the nature with impromptu mentalism or propless mentalism. But don't let that deter you. Everything in this download, if you give it the time that it deserves, will work 100%. Now that's a bold claim to make, but I have used some of the principles in this routine already, and I know that these will work. In fact, as soon as I learned the routines, I tried them out on my girlfriend who was just sat next to me and blew her mind with stuff that she hadn't seen me perform before. For the price of this download, it's $19.95, so I don't know how much that is, that's probably about 17 pounds in the UK. That is amazing value for what is essentially three extremely strong propless mentalism effects. I have students all over the world that I mentor and give lessons to, and they always want to learn about what are the best starting blocks for propolis mentalism. The three routines taught in this project give a really basic grounding in propolis mentalism, and I would highly recommend it to anybody who wants to give propolis mentalism a shot. If you're a beginner, there's gonna be some amazing stuff for you to get your teeth into. If you're a semi-pro or a seasoned pro, there's stuff in this project that you will learn still. There's a lot of stuff in there that is just knowledge that I'm sure a lot of people maybe aren't aware about or haven't really focused on or need to be reminded off again. So there we go guys, that is my review of Principle by Pete Turner and Illusionist. They've done a great project here and it really is a great grounding for propolis mentalism to be able to perform over the phone, via Skype or Zoom in this new virtual world that we live in. If you've liked the review, give the video a like, subscribe to the channel and smash the notification bell so that you get all the latest news and updates as they come in. Thanks for watching guys. Well done, Illusionist and Pete Turner, and I will see you all in the next one. Ciao.